I remember seeing Lil Latulele in high school and liking him very much, but I was even surprised at how successful he's been on the college level and then now looking to go into the NFL draft. When I saw him during a game in high school during his senior year, he was an aggressive, tough defensive tackle who caused a lot of problems uh, in the middle. Uh, not exactly a gap shooter, not an incredibly athletic guy at that point, but a guy who just overpowered uh, the center and guard, uh, got into the backfield a lot, and caused a lot of damage that way. Um, you know, I thought I should probably have seen him a little bit more just to get a more rounded idea of his game. Uh, I had seen him out here in Southern California when his team traveled out for an early season game. And so I wish I had seen him a lot more because obviously he's been an incredibly productive guy um, at Utah and a guy that's going to be wanted in the NFL, uh, you know, following in his brother's footsteps. So um, a strong, powerful kid, a kid that, you know, really has developed at Utah, which is no surprise because they continue to develop those guys year in and year out. They know how to maximize that production. And so he's going to be a guy that goes into uh, the NFL and is going to make a team pretty happy uh, down the line as long as he continues to develop. In high school, he was, you know, a kid who uh, just really bullied guys a little bit. Uh, and that, that's kind of expected for a guy with that kind of potential. Uh, has really developed at Utah. I've, I've been happy to see that and now uh, has a real chance to make an NFL roster.